It was right there on the map, so yeah. Uh, we're gonna go there, using our donkey. Penis. And... Hey there guys, and welcome to another Tibia episode. And this episode, I was thinking of uh, going to the Plains of Havoc, which is right here on the map. It was right there on the map, so yeah. Uh, we're gonna go there, using our donkey. Penis. And Luke is saying penis again. Uh, great. <laughs> uh, so the reason I wanted to show the planes of Havoc was because I have been just literally going there and killing some stuff. Uh, you, you can find some dragons, demon skeletons, orc leaders, I believe they're called. Uh, some demon skeletons, ghouls, tarantulas, cyclopses, different types of minotaurs, different types of orcs, giant spiders, which I can't take on yet, and the uh, dragon lord, and demodras, which is a power type of dragon, in case you didn't know. So we are definitely not going to be using a fire sword against them. Right, Luke? Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Still got the same old equipment that I had last episode. Because I can't really get anything better right now. Because I don't have enough money. Hmm. And also, my premium is ending in like six days, which is quite devastating. But some people seem to be happy about it. Wink, wink, hint, hint. Penis. Hmm. <clears throat> Uh, so yeah, is the t uh, no triangle tower's not. You know what? We're gonna go to the spike spike sword quest instead of planes of havoc. I changed my mind really quickly, but I can't remember where it is. Uh, is it here? Maybe here. I have no idea though. Wait, wait, no, never mind. We're going to the place of havoc. Screw what I just just said and uh, let's go. Dum -da -dum -da 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 -dum -da -da. I cannot see and I cannot do chant stuff. Luke, when you come on this server, do you want to do the desert quest? Not server, but to the mainland. Do you want to do the desert quest? <laughs> no. Oh, okay. I'm not coming. I'm not going to stay on the mainland. Oh, so you just get into the mainland and stop playing to be stopping. Mm. Ah, okay. Then I guess I can sell the spike sword that I've been keeping for you. Okay. Also, I can ki kill Wyans, Vians, something now. I have no idea how they're pronounced, uh, but we're going to go kill one right now. Oh, they're right. One of them is right over there. They do large, uh, quite high poison damage, and that's really it. They don't do a lot more damage. Their poison damage starts at 20 and goes down from that, so yeah. Just a bit higher than a scorpion's. Even though some scorpions aren't that poisonous, apparently to be they are. Because logic. Uh, hello, spider. So last episode, I believe we did the arena quest. Yeah, uh, I got my bronze trophy. Trophy. Hmm. Pretty cool. I also got a freaking fantastic sword that I'm not going to use because it's a two-handed sword. So I guess it's not so fantastic. Luke, if you want, you can mute me if I'm being annoying. I'm interrupting. No. Too tired to speak. <laughs> okay, so uh, up here, um, east, no, west, east, west, west of the north, 
is a weird thingy, and if you go up here, you can kill one, like I'm about to do right now. Uh, you want to stay diagonal to them because the their poison fields uh, miss like their diagonal spots from them, so you'll only be hit by their uh, attacks and their poison that they've already poisoned you with, instead of being attacked by the. And I believe they run. Yep, they run. And they are considered a dragon as well, like a distant species of the dragon. And I got a weird talisman straight away, which is pretty good. I don't know how much they're worth, but yeah. Uh, so, Xana parks this sh sugar. And Xura echo this thing. And if you go south of this weird thing, you'll be able to hit the Plains of Havoc, which I have literally no trouble with killing mobs there except the giant spiders uh, because they have increased their spawn uh, after an update I think it was a 2007 update uh, so there's like three giant spiders trying to kick your ass and I'm not very good at being kicked no hang on that can sound right. anyway uh, if you keep heading south of here I don't believe I've done a Plains of Havoc tour before so that's why I'm doing it now here is a psych. No, here are the min Minotaurs. Uh, there's some Minotaur Mages, normal Minotaurs, Minotaur Guards, Minotaur Archers. You want to take out the Minotaur Mages straight away because they can be a bother if you have no magic protection. Uh, so, yeah, that's basically it. I drop some neat gold and I have my obsidian knife to skin them. And there's some piggy banks. I also had a. I also bought two piggy banks, and I didn't get much gold from them, which was crap. Hello, Minotaur Mage. A Minotaur Horn. Let's pick it up. Uh, so, I just like to kill all these Minotaurs off and pick up their gold and any good things they drop, like horns. And then I like to skin them because Minotaur leather is worth like 100 gold, something near that. Uh, so it's good to just sell it in the mar on the market. And he dropped the blue robe, with purple robe, which I don't believe, which I believe is not uh, that profitable. I used a smart word there. How was your Ian business studies, Luke? Shut the hell up! <laughs> <laughs> I need to skin this Minotaur. I, I suppose Minotaur Mages are the hardest ones to kill over here because of their penetrable magic. Did I say that right? And the Minotaur Guards are second because of their damage they deal. Uh, but to the west of the Minotaur bit is a Cyclops camp, which again is not too hard uh, for me. But for lower levels, obviously, it would be. Uh, Plains of Havoc is a good area to e experience, I mean, get some experience before you actually come here, because if you walk too far down, you can hit dragons, or if you walk too far east, no, west, you can hit some giant spiders, and I think dragon lords over there as well, but I'm not too sure. I'm probably wrong in saying that. And look at these Cyclopses six-packs. At six pack. Uh, but in my bright sword, I deal quite a bit of damage, so their six packs do nothing. Unlike mine. Uh, no. Okay. Uh, so south of here is the dragon. Two dragon spawns, I believe it's two. And some demon skeletons and the other types of orcs that you may find. Meat. Thank you very much. I will eat that. Uh, so, overall, it's a good place to, as I've already said, um, level up on at this level because you don't actually you waste a lot of potions, etc. If you have good equipment, that is. Otherwise, you're probably better off in, like, what else? What is that? Um, Kazardun Mines, maybe? Or the Mount Sternum, or 
Ghostlands, I believe it's called. So there's some more Minotaurs over here. Just keep walking south until you hit that temple area. And there will be some demon skeletons. Along with the orcs that you will find. Like orc berserkers, orc leaders, orc shamans, etc, etc. And we drop a halberd. Which again is a good profit. Uh, but it can be kept quite heavy, so making loot bags will be quite smart. Especially if you have, you've done the quest to have like extra mailboxes open, because I believe there's some mailboxes uh, around here. So if you keep heading south, you will find some... Okay, south east you will find some demons, skeletons, skeletons and more skeletons as you can see and tarantulas and another and ghouls which again are not too hard to kill so don't worry like I was I was worried of a pixeled game I was being I was scared I was being frightened by a pixeled game. <laughs> okay, that is a fair exit. That was a good exit. Taking a deep breath and then... Oh god, there's a giant spider right here. Uh, they shouldn't be any, so someone must have lured it over here. Like, Lantero. Uh, yeah, Lantera probably heard it. As you can see, there's some demon skeletons, corpses. There's some demon skeleton corpses with a demon skeleton hand that I would gladly pick up. And another one. Uh, so, here, uh, if you go down this hole, the one to the left of me is a giant spider that is currently dead. But uh, the human that is there, like, kind of there uh, is uh, gives you a book and what you want to do is just uh, rope back up uh, to the right of the teleporter because the teleporter just keeps you here it's like a trap it's like a goddamn trap uh, so as you can see there are many orcs as you can see there's an orc berserker etc etc that is made by a big spider giant spider Uh, tarantula leg, which I collect, uh, so I'll take it. Oh, there's some weirds. I never knew they were here. Well, that's just better for me because I can kill them pretty easily. And I should probably stay diagonal to them. Come on, don't run away. Don't run away, you silly little thing. Okay, uh, so we got a dragon ham, which actually weighs a ton. Uh, by ton, I mean 30 OZ. Uh, and that can add up pretty fast. Because I was carrying five yesterday, and I already had 150 OZ filled up just by bringing dragon ham with me. So, uh, if you're going to get better loot, then obviously pick it up, because dragon ham isn't worth that much. And it's not it's such a good profit as to drag it along with you everywhere you go. Uh, so here should be some dragons, if that guy didn't kill them, but I'm guessing he did. Yeah, he did. There's a dragon corpse right here. And he dropped a broadsword, which I'm probably going to pick up. Uh, yeah, I'm going to pick up. 20... Well, I know I'm going to pick it up because I just picked it up. It's not like I'm watching this. And then picking it up. Uh, so yeah. Then if you... Uh, there's nothing here, no. Uh, I've been, like, all the way up to about there. Hang on, let me just get it in, because I don't think you can see my mouse. I've been everywhere up to about there on the map, as if I zoom out, it's, like, right there. Uh, because 
there I met like two giant spiders which were trying to kill me and I can't kill them as quickly as I can dragons so I can't take more than one on uh, and even one is uh, quite a bit of trouble for me because I use up a lot of potions as they take a lot of damage from me so it would be better to be a paladin in this case and I will pick this spear up because they are worth a little bit uh, so if you want me to demonstrate then I will go down here uh, not using a rope, using this, and demonstrate, never mind, because the spider is still not alive. Uh, but I don't want to venture off, off too far east, since, yeah. Oh, come on, hit the tarantula, you stupid sword. Oh, God damn it! I was poisoned. More tarantula eggs and more gold. Uh, but as you can see, uh, good XP in this area, good loot if you can get it, uh, if you're lucky enough. Uh, you can make quite a lot of profit if you make loot bags, especially if you make loot bags. If you drag things along with you, then that's quite a bit of profit too. Uh, so yeah, uh, bringing a obs an obsidian knife is very wise in this situation. Because quite a lot of things in here you can skin and then sell the... Uh, sell the leather or whatever you managed to collect for quite a bit of profit and I missed I mean I didn't kill it with one shot which is quite bad for me at this point and I'm I'm guessing you can hear the Skype stuff so I'm probably gonna have to cut that out or silence it or quieten it down mm, yeah I recently had my, actually recently, uh, Thursday, I had my uh, biology exam, not GCSE because I'm not doing my GCSEs yet, uh, but I, ha I did that exam and yesterday I did my uh, geography exam, uh, again a practice one, not a proper GCSE one. Uh, so yeah, that was basically a short tour of the Plains of Havoc. Once I can actually take on the giant spiders positively, I will come back here at around level 60, 50 maybe, and uh, show the whole thing to you, uh, because I know where some areas are uh, placed around here. As you can see, there's a lot of spiders and a giant spider right there. Uh, so, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Tibia and the Plains of Havoc tour. Because um, I was looking for planes of planes of havoc tours and I couldn't find any, so I decided to make my my own, and I totally missed him. Uh, so yeah, basically that's it. Uh, easy kills at the minor tours. Um, I'm just gonna finish killing off these minor tours and then we're gonna sign off. So as I said, good profit, good XP. Uh, Good spot for levels 40s to 60s. And thank you very much. Goodbye.